Hello everybody, this is JTOMALI9681. I'm making this update on all three of my channels for my main channel, for my gaming channel, SCATCAT9681, and my other backup channel that has my, my real name on it. And I just want to make an update for anybody who's, who's wondering or whatever that the reason I haven't been doing anything on my gaming channel lately is because I have a strike because I had a film, you know, that was in parts originally on that channel. And what I don't understand is why all those got deleted and I end up getting a strike for copyright. But yet there are other people who have the same film who do not own the film either, don't have any rights to it, and they have it up there for the same reason that I had it up. It's just for anybody who wants to watch it. And they don't have a strike or anything against them. I don't understand how that works, why YouTube or Google does that crap. It, it's stupid. It's really pathetically stupid. So... It's sometime in February, I don't remember exactly when it is offhand, that the strike will be removed. So I'm waiting until then to start doing uh, gaming videos again. And my main channel, which has like childhood memory stuff, you know, for anybody that, that brings up childhood memories like Sesame Street, the old Sesame Street, or Disney, or anything like that, that was old school. That bring, you know, like I said, that brings childhood memories. But I also have Bible studies and testimonies and other things like that. And the reason I haven't been doing anything lately since I think somewhere near the middle of January, the last time I did anything, is because I've actually started doing uh, job training through the Goodwill Industries, which the Goodwill Industries is paying me for it. And I'm actually doing job training at a Holiday Inn Express. And I'm in the uh, laundry department. I'm very much overweight, and I haven't done work in a long time like, like that, having to be on my feet a lot, either moving around or stationary, or both, which is what I have to do with both as part of that job. And... For the first two weeks, it's been havoc on my feet, and I end up having a problem with my legs. I'm not really sure what the problem is, but the feeling of it is like a, a straight line. It's like a line going down both my legs on the on the outer thigh areas, and it's usually it's like some kind of a numb or tingling feeling, but lately it's been more of a burning feeling. But not the same kind of burning that that you would have like if you were working out. If you were if you were getting exercise and your muscles have that get that burning. It, it's not that, it's a different kind of burning. I don't really know how to explain it. You know, for what I for what I understand about your weight is and people debate on this, for every pound of weight you carry above your waist is six pounds of pressure on your legs, your knees, and your feet, especially your feet. So just from my upper body itself, I'm probably carrying about anywhere from 1,000 to 1,800 pounds of pressure. Some people say it's only four pounds of pressure. Some people say five. I understand it as six, so there's not too much of a difference there. And so that's why it, it wrecks havoc on my feet. But I'm, I've been getting used to it this third week because I've been through it three weeks now. And I actually really like the job. I mean, it's not an actual part-time or, or full-time. It's just job training right now. And I actually really like it. It's been doing pretty, it's been going pretty good. And I only work four hours Monday through Thursday, and then every Friday I have to go to class for two hours, which I also get paid for that. And, of course, you know, I'm a believer in Jesus Christ, Yeshua HaMashiach. So, I always pray every day that 
he will give me the strength. That my Elohim will give me the strength to go through each day, one day at a time. As Yahshua has said, one day at a time. Tomorrow will take care of itself. And he's really been getting me through this. And I'm enjoying it more and more. Because I have to wake up early in the morning, get myself ready, and then I have to take the bus, transfer downtown, and then get off at the bus stop. Then I have to cross the parking lot of the Bur of a Bur the Burlington Coat Factory and Big Lots. And then I have to walk up the street a little bit to get to the Holiday Inn Express. And I have to walk from the Holiday Inn Express back across the parking lot, catch the bus back home. So it's all been pretty good and pretty really good experience. And I've just been tired and just didn't feel like doing Bible studies or anything lately. So I'm just giving an update to everybody uh, what's been going on. And so with that, this is JTML and I681. And I'll hope to see you all soon. See ya.